my name is Monique. And I'm Naveen from Before You Play. And today we have another playthrough for you. This time it is for a game called Tidal Blades Banner Festival. This one's designed by J.B. Howell as well as Michael Mihilsik, and it's published by Lucky Duck Games as well as Druid City Games, who are helping sponsor this video. And in this game, we are going to be competing as merchants trying to score the most amount of points, aka profit, in this game. That's right. The gameplay is up to five players, and it is actually a standalone game that is set in the world of Tidal Blades, mm -hmm. if you're familiar with those titles. Although, in this game, the primary mechanic is trick-taking. Mm -hmm. And so, as per usual, today we're going to start with a teach of the game and then go into our full two-player playthrough. And if you're interested in jumping around, we'll include timestamps down below. Now, if you're interested in this game, you can sign up to be notified for when the pre-orders go live, which should be this week. And so once they do go live, we'll be including a link to that in the description below. Now, if you can all do us a big favor and turn on your click on subtitles, just in case you make any rules mistakes, we can add those corrections there. Also, if you like these kind of videos and you want to see more in the future, please consider subscribing. And without further ado, we are ready to begin. Let's do it. So if you would please direct your attention to the center of the table, <laughs> we're all set up here for a two-player game of Tidal Blades Banner Festival. Welcome to the city. Now as merchants, each player represents a specific trading house. And so I'm gonna be playing today as the Tentacular Stocks and Rarities. Nice, I am the Aquarius Imports. And so over the course of three days, we are going to be playing these merchandise cards from our hands, placing our banners in various areas around the board, as well as collecting Goya Starfruit in the effort to earn the most amount of profits. And so like we were mentioning, the game is played over the course of three days. And at the start of each day, each player is going to be dealt a hand of eight merchandise cards. And over the course of the day, we're going to be playing a total of eight bouts, one card per bout. Now at the start of each bout, the first thing that happens is whoever the lead player is gets to move these, this trade gate up to four spaces. We're going to skip this step in the first round, mm -hmm. and so you'll understand the significance of this trade gate later. Then each player is going to simultaneously select a merchandise card from their hand and play it face down in front of them. Because we're playing a two-player game, before that happens, we're also going to play one merchandise card face up. And then after everybody reveals their cards, we're going to play a second one face up. But we're going to leave this unrevealed for now. Until you're ready, Naveen. Oh, yes, I'm ready. <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead and reveal. Boom. Okay, so once we've revealed our cards, because again, this is a two-player game, we reveal a fourth one. But just so you know, in a three-player game, you only play with one extra card, and in four- and five-player games, you don't draw an extra card at all. Now, before we talk about resolving these cards, let's talk about the anatomy of a merchandise card. There are four different colors of merchandise cards. There's yellow, teal, orange, and purple. And each uh, suit has numbers zero through nine, and all cards are unique. Now, because we are playing a two-player game, our gameplay of it will not have any zeros at all. Mm -hmm. And so at the bottom of each card, you'll also notice a specific action that you might be able to take, depending on where you lie in resolving these cards. Mm -hmm. Now, let's take a look at the board. The board is divided into two different regions that's separated by this long white line over here. And each region is also separated into two different quadrants that each share a space called the tower. Now, the order in which you resolve these merchandise cards is dependent on where the trade gate is. And so in our example right now, the trade gate is in this yellow quadrant, which displays the hierarchy of suits right over here. So as you can see, each quadrant will have a different uh, hierarchy, starting with the quadrant's color being the, the highest rank. Mm -hmm. And so in this bout that we just played, the yellow suit is going to be the highest, followed by teal, then purple, and then orange. So it always goes clockwise from there. So going back to the card that we just played, Naveen is going to have the highest ranked card, mm -hmm. followed by the uh, neutral player, then me, and then the lowest will be, again, the neutral player. Now, neutral players, by the way, don't take any actions. They're just there to help uh, resolve the hierarchy of cards. Mm -hmm. Now, the action that you get to take during the bout is going to be dependent on where your card lies in that hierarchy. If the card you played was the highest in the hierarchy, like Naveen's, mm -hmm. then you actually don't get to take the action of your card. It's not when you get to do it. Instead, you get to move your watercraft that's shown on the inside track over here. If you play the highest card, you just move your watercraft to wherever the trade gate is. Whenever your watercraft moves past the eight space, then you get to flip over the topmost card of your character deck. And so this is going to be important because each player has their own identical uh, set of seven cards in their character deck. Mm -hmm. And each character card is numbered one through 28 at the very, very bottom here. And so at the end of the game, you're going to score a number of profit equal to whatever is showing on your uh, most recent character card played. Mm -hmm. So moving your watercraft is a way in which you can dig deeper and deeper into this deck. In addition, character cards two, three, four, and five each also show a specific stunt location at the very top of the card. And so anytime those cards are your topmost character, whenever your watercraft lands exactly on the stunt location, you get a Goya Starfruit from the middle pool here. 
There are several ways, by the way, in which you can earn the star fruit, not just through um, the stunt locations. And if at any time the pool gets depleted, then we immediately will have a feast. And so whoever has the most number of star fruit in their supply at that time gets one profit per star fruit. Mm -hmm. And everybody else gets half the amount of uh, profit per star fruit that they have. Rounding up. So Rounding if up. I had three, it would be half is 1.5. So I'd get two profit in the end. Yes. And so, like I said, that is just another way in which you can earn profit. Now, before we move on, if your watercraft is on the same space as the trade gate, when mm -hmm. you play the highest card, then you actually get to take a full lap. Yeah, full revolution. And so that's what happens if you play the highest rank card. Mm -hmm. Now, if you play the lowest rank card, you actually get to take the action that's listed on your merchandise card. A lot of times they'll allow you to advance your watercraft or gain additional fruit or even put out your banners, which we'll talk about in a second. And some of them, namely the number nines, will allow you to place this card into your scoring pile and they're gonna be worth five profit at the end of the game. Mm -hmm. But that's kind of difficult to do because again, nine is the highest uh, number in a suit and you have to play the lowest rank card in order for you to activate that. Right. And for everyone else who played a card in the middle ranks, you get to put out a banner. And so in our example, I played the purple six and I was one of the middle ranked cards here. Mm -hmm. So I get to put a banner in the same quadrant as the trade gate. Now, the way that it works is I would start from the front of the dock here and kind of follow the dock downwards, looking for the first available space that meets the criteria of the card I played. So in this example, it would be this space because the card I played is purple. Mm -hmm. So then I would place my banner on that spot, gaining me one uh, star fruit immediately. Each spot can only hold one banner, but if we were both to claim the same spot during the same bout, then we would both be able to place our banners there. Exactly. Placing banners in the dock spaces is one of the more major ways for you to score a profit because at the end of each day, we're going to have a scoring phase where we count the majorities in each uh, region. Right. And whoever has the most number of banners in each region gets six points, second most gets three points. And because we're playing a two player game, we have these four uh, neutral player banners that are actually covering up a spot that says odd or even. Mm -hmm. So we don't have access to that. And uh, that also means that we have to put a minimum of two banners in each region for us to score points for that. Lastly, if you don't find a space that meets the criteria of your card, then your banner gets placed into the tower. And so each region has one tower that connects both quadrants. The significance of the tower is even though you don't get an immediate benefit for placing your banner there, at the end of each day after the scoring phase, we're going to remove all of our banners from all the spaces except for the tower. Mm -hmm. So it's a nice way for you to keep your banner um, in a region and uh, there is no limit to the number of banners that can go on the tower spaces. Once we resolve everyone's actions, then our merchandise cards get discarded and we play another bout. And whoever played the lowest ranked card in the current bout becomes the lead player for the next one. To start the next bout, the lead player gets to move the trade gate up to four spaces around uh, the board. So it's always in a clockwise fashion. If the lead player was a neutral player, then the trade gate always moves three spaces automatically. The day ends once we played all of the merchandise cards from our hand. And so in a two player game, that's going to be eight, eight bouts. At the end of the day, we go into that scoring phase where we count the area majorities for each region, and then you set up for the next day. Once we've completed all three days, we have one final feast where we basically score our uh, star fruit, mm -hmm. and then we go into endgame scoring. And endgame scoring is going to be basically however much profit we already have in our supply, any merchandise cards in our scoring supply that has a profit on it, mm -hmm. and you add the profit that's shown on the topmost character card, and then whoever has most points at that point wins. And in the case of a tie, by the way, whoever has the most banners on the board wins. And that's pretty much it. We're just going to go ahead and get cleaned up and then get started with our playthrough. All right, we are fully reset and we've also dealt out our hand of eight merchandise cards mm -hmm. to start the day. Yep. And so are you ready to begin day one? Let's do it. All right. I'm so ready. like we we're mentioning in the teach, we're going to skip the first uh, step in mm -hmm. the first day, which means the trade gate will be here yep. in uh, this quadrant. So we're going to go ahead and reveal the uh, the neutral player's merchandise card. Ready? Let's find out. So this is the face up one. Purple, purple six. six. And I'm just going to place this one here for after we choose our cards. Yes. The uh, color hierarchy is going to be yellow is the highest, blue followed by purple, and then the lowest is orange. orange. So this okay. is a, a middle color right here. All right. Ready? I've chosen You've mine. chosen? Okay. Yes. Are you yeah. ready? Yeah. One, two, three, reveal. Oh, purple. interesting. Ooh. I chose a two teal. Let's see what the neutral player has chosen. Hi. Oh, interesting. So the they, they went yellow three. All right, let's oh, resolve these. Okay. So highest ranked is going to be neutral player followed by me, which means I'm a mid-ranked card. I get to place a banner out right. in the quadrant of the trade gate. 
I go from the start of the dock looking for where my card meets the requirement and looks like it's that spot. Yeah. Now because... this all happens simultaneously technically, yeah. but uh, for demonstration purpose. We're gonna go through one by the one. motions. Mm -hmm. So my card is teal, I place that there and I get a star fruit. And that's me. So then we move on to the next one. Yeah, they played six, I played five. Yes, they both play the same color, but they play the higher number. So this is technically a, a mid, mid rank. Yep. And you have the lowest. Yeah, lowest. So it says place one banner at this region's tower. So this way I have a little bit in always there. So yep. that's good. So this region again is these two quadrants put together. Right. That's not bad. Not bad. All right, may I have your card, please? Yes, that goes into the discard. Yes. So these are going to all get discarded and. We are going to set up for the next bout. So the lead player is going to be you because you played the lowest, lowest card. Yep. So now you get to choose up to four spaces. You yep. must move the trade gate at least one. Oh, I will. Okay, so <laughs> I'm going to move it. Yes, oh, we'll I go will. One, two, three, four. Oh, okay. I'm going to move it four spaces. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Very interesting. Why would you move so far? And then let's see what uh, we have on deck. Yeah, so now this time around purple is the highest. All right. So they're going to play. Oh, uh, purple. purple three. You're starting off high there. And then this is the other the card. card. Huh, yeah, that's tricky. Traverse. So this yeah. is a, it's a new region. It is a new region. Okay, I'm ready, are you ready? I'm ready. One, two, three, reveal. reveal. Ooh. Okay, I played a yellow too. Okay. And then they played oh, purple shoot. eight. Wow. Okay. That's fine. Okay, so wow. highest ranked is purple. Them. So they are the highest card. Wow, nice. Followed by you, so you're a mid rank I'm card. I'm mid rank. This is not bad though, because <laughs> purple here has two, um, two star fruit yeah. that I'm going to be able to get. So I'm going to be able to place out a banner here because I assess, yeah. go here, and the reward is two star fruit. So I was kind of playing this four knowing that that three was out there, uh -huh. and I'm willing to take this as a mid range, but I'm also willing to move my watercraft all the way. So okay. it worked out you're to a an extent, to... yes. You're a little bit more strategic than I am <laughs> in terms of this. Yeah. So after you, it's going to be them. Them. And then I cannot believe that you all played purple. I had some other cards in my hand that would have been better okay. as a lowest rank card, but alas. What does that say? It just says place the banner in the quadrant's nearest available space. Oh, so I would have gotten that even if it was a mid-rank card. Yeah. You see what I mean? Totally. Ugh, I didn't foresee that. But I get a, I get a star fruit, you so do. that's it's nice. 2-2 on the star fruit. All right. So that right, is so the you're end gonna be choosing that about I'm the lead go. player. Yeah. So I get to decide. I get to decide where the git goes. Sure. Okay, well I'm gonna move it one space. One space. Just one. Right there. Okay. Which makes potentially playing the highest card kind of interesting, right? It does. All right. First card, they're playing a teal three. Teal three. That's a third level. Yeah. Third hmm. level in the hierarchy. Yeah. And there's that other one. I have made my decision, just so you know. Okay. I'm just going all in. Ready? So have I. One, two, three, reveal. Oh my god, you have the what are the chances that you would have the nine? <laughs> oh, I have oh, the nine. <laughs> stinker. All right, well, this is what they're playing. Oh, well, they're wow. playing they're playing a, an orange. Okay. Okay, so, so the highest one is nine. Is so the watercraft is gonna go all the way around. Yes. And back to the start. I cross from eight to one. So yep. I do reveal my topmost card. Yep. Boom. Just like that. Very good. And again, when you play the highest ranked card, you get to move your watercraft to where the trade gate is. Mm -hmm. But because Naveen's watercraft was already where it, where it is, it's best case scenario, you get to move a whole lap. He passed space number eight, which is some flip over. I can't. Which I was trying to get to in the last in the last one when I played the four, but I guess it just made it that much better. Ah, uh, how do I win this game? <laughs> <laughs> After Naveen uh, is me, so I have a mid ranked card here. I'm going to place my banner right here on the orange. There. Yeah. So and I get it's pretty good. Two fruit. I'm on my way. We're on our way to having a feast mm -hmm. real soon here. Yeah. And that's it because the neutral players don't they don't uh, they don't get to take any actions. But no. that does mean that the neutral player is the lead player, which means the trade gate is going to move up three spaces. Three spaces. One, two, three. Exactly three spaces. Yeah. All right. Are you ready for the next bout? Yes. Here is the first neutral card, yellow four. Yellow four. And then that's the second one. And as a reminder, yellow is the highest ranked. Orange is the lowest rank Yellow now. Yellow is the highest rank. Okay, I think I'm ready. You're ready? Yeah. I would think that the uh, card I chose, this is this is gonna be it. And it's never it. Yeah, uh, gosh, I guess I'll play this one. Ready? Yeah. One, two, three, reveal. Yellow. Okay, yeah. I played an orange four. Let's see what they played. A teal four. Teal four, so you're the lowest. I am the lowest, okay. fantastic. So highest I'm, rank is you. Highest me, so I'm just gonna move my watercraft all the way to the four spot. Yeah. That's it. Uh, then it's them, 
fall, I don't know, them, followed by them again, and mm -hmm. then I have the lowest uh, rank card. So, what is your card so my jellyfish smoothie, by the way, what is yours? Is smoked band smoked clamp? Smoked band clamp, <laughs> yeah. And mine says I gain one fruit for each banner that I have in this quadrant. quadrant. So you have one banner. One banner. So you'll get one fruit. <laughs> I get one fruit. But that does clear out our uh, our pool. And so we are going to now have a feast a immediately. Feast. How many? I have fruit? two. You I have, have five. Five. So this is going to gain me five profit, one per star fruit since I have the most. Here's your five. Thank you. And Naveen will get half. Half. Round it up. Round it up. So I'll get one. One. That's okay. <laughs> I'm not worried. And the star fruit go back, go back <laughs> into the pool. I'm thank not, you. I don't think you should be worried. I'm very worried, actually. All right, may I yes, discard you have your card? My card? Yes, thank, thank you. you. So I think I'm the lead player. You are. Right? Mm -hmm. All right, so I get to choose how far. Up to four spaces. How far do we go? How many more cards do we have left in this in this uh, day? We're four more there. bouts. Yeah, we're halfway there. Okay, well, I'm going to advance the gate three spaces. Okay. We're going to go one, two, three. Mm. So we're in the purple region. Purple is the highest ranked, and teal is the lowest. Let's go ahead and see what they're going to play. So yellow. yellow six. Followed by something. that. Followed by that. Yellow followed by something. All right. Okay, I'm ready. I'm going to play this card. <sighs> okay, I'm going to play this. Ready? Yep. One, two, three, reveal. Oh, oh I think the lowest. playing teal. No! <laughs> what does yours say? Uh, hold on, let's reveal what okay. they're playing, because maybe they'll play something. Nope, they play no, yellow. They play so yellow. they're high and mid. All right, wow. so highest ranked is going to be premium equipment, mm -hmm. <laughs> followed by Migi jewelry. Okay. And then looks like me. I can't believe you're the lowest. You have VIP tickets. I'm selling VIP tickets to, to Babs over here. So this would let me place two banners at this region's tower, but unfortunately I'm a middle rank, so I can only place that one, and it's going to be uh, here. here. Yep. So at least I have a spot for it. And you get a So get me a star fruit. fruit. Yeah. So okay. I'm not mad. Mine says just place one banner at this region's tower. I also did Mickey Jewelry. Yeah, same, same number. Yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and put this out over there. Okay. Mm -hmm. I guess my action is a little bit better. A little bit, but at least it stifled you from being able to put out two. <laughs> and you don't remove your banners from the from tower. The tower. So, so you have I'm a like permanent kind of here now. Stake, yeah. Yeah, on both um, of them. On, in that region. So I go, go I'm going to move the thing, huh? Yep, you are the lead player. Hmm. How many spaces? Okay, we're going to move it four spaces. We're going to go one, two, three, four. Oh, interesting. Whoa, sorry, tower. Wow. Wait. Oh, I see All what right, you're doing. Let's go ahead and uh, reveal. Naveen is going to, you're going to try to be the highest card. I think so. <laughs> Maybe. Oh, Teal, seven. seven. A that's a good number. Oh, that's the second to highest color. And then this is the other one. Next one. All right. What to play? Yellow is the highest. Mm -hmm. All right. I've chosen. Are you ready? Same. Yep. One, two, three. Reveal. Nine yellow. Six teal. <laughs> What are we going for? Oh, you oh, you played the highest. I did, yeah. Okay. So I moved it there to set it up. Well, so you I wasted play this. a nine. <laughs> I mean, sure. All right. They played a purple two. Okay. Highest ranked is you. Me. So uh, I'm going to be able to move my watercraft all the way around, crossing over eight into one, back to the three, nice. exposing my next one right there. So now if I ever move my watercraft onto a five spot, yeah. exactly on there, then I collect one of the fruit. Yep. Yeah. You have, a new, you have a stunt location. I have a stunt location. And now you're going to gain three profit at mm -hmm. the end of the game. So that's nice. Yep. Next up is this card followed by mine. So I have a mid rank card. I have to place a banner out. And unfortunately, it's a teal card, which does not fit any of these criteria. It's going to go in the tower. Which is good. So you have three now. I it's mean, good. So. I just don't get a fruit. No. But it is what it is. Okay. And so they are going to be the new lead player. So they play the lowest card. So they're going to move it three. Yep. One, two, three. Yes. Very good. All right. Are you ready to move on to the next bout? Yes. This is the first card. It is a teal nine. So that's where that that's thing went. That's the highest valued so card. In they this are playing the location. highest no matter what. Wow. Basically. Yeah. Right? <laughs> <laughs> and then Oops. this is the next one. Not good. So teal is the highest, yellow is the lowest. Decision making wise, it's getting a little bit tougher because we only have two cards left, two merchandise yeah, cards you're left stuck with what you got. in this day. And again, <laughs> yeah. after, at the end of the day, we're going to have the region scoring. Yes. So let's just, let's just kind of see. How many we each have, right? Okay, yeah. So this region... It's 2-2-2. Two, two, two. It's 2-2-2. Two, two, two. So that could be friendly. Here it's Monique with three, a dummy player with two, and I only have one in the tower here. So you're not scoring not any points friendly. the way that it is right now, right? That's right. All right, I have chosen. It was 50-50. Uh, <laughs> one, yeah. two, three, reveal. Okay, I played a, play a low yellow one. one. Huh? Let's see what they played. Purple, Purple seven. seven. Okay. All right, highest. Uh, second is second you. Second me. So I'm just going to go ahead and place out my banner here, oh, no. getting myself a fruit. Uh-oh. So now you're leading in that region. I am, yeah. Um, after you, it's them, and then I played the lowest rank. So mine is the Tusk Liquor, by the way. What okay. did you sell? Oh, a custom sun pod. Oh, that sounds useful. <laughs> so Nyrock over here 
is going to allow me to gain one fruit and advance my watercraft two spaces. Oh, okay. So that's not really, I mean, I guess any, any space towards eight You'll take is it. helpful. Yeah. But I, I do like the, the fruit. Mm -hmm. So that's that. I am now the, the lead player for right. our final bout in the day. That's it. So I'm definitely going to move the trade gate uh, two spaces. Two spaces, okay. And let's see what they're playing. They're playing a, an orange seven. So again, this time it's purple, purple and teal is lowest. And that's a, the second card. I think we just have to play out our last card, right? Yeah, just play it. Yeah. One, two, three, reveal. Okay. You playing the lowest? I'm, I might. We'll see what this is. I think you're playing the, I think, oh yeah. Currently. Yeah. What is it? They're oh. playing the highest. You are playing the lowest. <gasps> I'm playing the lowest. Do you lowest. even know what that, what does that even say? That means I'm not going to win this region. <laughs> nice. That's good. Okay. So they're the highest, followed by them. You're a middle rank. Middle, there is no orange to put, but I am back in the tower. Hello. Wow, you have two two banners in here. Yes. That's not good. We're set. You got two permanent banners. <laughs> All right. Uh, I have the lowest one, so I'm selling a Micronic Booster. Mm. And uh, it says I can advance my watercraft one space for each of my banners in this region. I have two banners in the okay. region. So so slowly moving it. Dude, my watercraft is super slow. It's moving. We uh, we didn't practice. We didn't train for this race. No. But <laughs> it is what it is. Yeah. So that's the end of the, the day. day. We yeah. played out all eight bouts. Let me just go ahead and discard these. We are now going to go into region scoring. Mm -hmm. So um, I guess we can analyze this one first. Naveen, you have four banners. Four banners. One, two, three, four to so, my two. So I get six. You get six. And yeah, ties I are friendly. Ties are friendly, yeah. So you and the dummy player get three each. Yep. Yeah. But Thank they don't get you. points. There you go. And then for this region, it's just you with the six. Just me with the six. Yeah, I'm not in this. And you don't that because you only have the one. Yeah, right? it's because I spun around with my uh, watercraft in this yeah. region. So. So you kind of made up just, for it a little bit with that. Kind of. I need to get deeper in this deck to really make it a thing. But yeah. yes, I'm gonna try. And you can you should land on your stunt locations mm -hmm. so you can get some more fruit. All right, so that's the end of the day. We are going to go ahead and clean up. Naveen, would you care to shuffle the merchandise cards? <laughs> sure. I'm going to remove the the banners from the non-tower uh, spaces. So it's going to be this, this, unfortunately, these. Wow, it's like all of my no, banners. Mine right here. And yours. The neutral banners uh, will stay. stay. And I will be the lead player for the next bout. Okay, so I've shuffled the cards. Now we deal out eight each. For day two. Yep. We're a third of the way done. How are you feeling? Uh, I want more points. <laughs> <laughs> you want more profit? I would like more profit. That would be that would be something. All right, I have a better variety of colors this time. Let's just say last uh, the the last day I only had three of the four colors in my hand. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see. Starting off the second day, we have one and one in this region, and you have two in here. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna move the gate twice. One, two. Who you say? So we're in the the orange quadrant. So orange highest, purple lowest. Ready? Yes. This is the first card. It's a teal five, okay. and then that's the second. Choose wisely, Naveen. All right, I think I'm going with this one. Yep. One, two, three, reveal. Oh Eight. my god, are you kidding me? Yes. Wow. You've this done this. Second time this happened. Well, let's see. This could be the orange nine. It better not be. Oh, oh. that was close. <laughs> it was an orange, but not the nine. Orange. All right, Naveen, you have the highest rank. All right, Watercraft going in a big circle. Um, unfortunately, it does not land on the five. But this is meaning this is going to go away. Yeah. And now this is revealed. So now my new target is the four spot. Oh, that's nice. Potentially. You just gained three profit. I did. I did. Very good. I mean, but you're going to get two, you know, you're going to put out your, your banner yes. here. I'm a mid rank, so yeah. I'm going to place out my banner. It's tough. You got to um, really go for it. This spot right here. So I get two, two of those. fruit. Yeah, it seems pretty good. All right. And then the... Neutral player is going to be the now now the lead player. Yeah, so they're gonna move three. One, yeah. two, three, and here's my card. Thank you. All right. So now we are in the. This would be a perfect time for you. The teal quadrant. To go in a this big is circle. a perfect time. Oh my gosh. Okay. Well, let's see what they're playing. And you do it. They're playing a they're teal playing one. They're playing the lowest, highest ranked card. If it's that makes bad. sense. Yeah, that makes sense. All right. I I think I've chosen. Chosen. Okay, I've chosen. One, two, three. Reveal. VIP tickets. Yeah, dang. Okay, wow. Awesome. Got a high well, card. let's just hope this isn't the nine. nine. Teal. Okay, good. Okay. Oh, Jelly, did I get the lowest? Jellyfish smoothie. Did I get the lowest? I believe you did. Wow. Wow. We only played the top two colors. Oh, this so is great. This is good. I played the eight teal. I'm the highest ranked, which means I get to take a full lap. You do. Yay. To flip your card. So I'm going around, and I'm going to flip. Have I not flipped anyone? Nope. Oh. It's, oh no! Yeah, <laughs> it's I not play, the biggest feat for gained, you right now. I got one profit out of that, but yeah. it's a start. Okay, it's something. It is something. Oh, okay. I have some slight regrets. So they are the two mids, 
and surprisingly, I'm the small, I'm the lowest. Yeah. So this one says, "Advance your water." This is a, a micronic, micronic booster? booster from Korg. Uh, <laughs> Advance your watercraft one space for each of your banners in this region. I happen to have two banners in this region. Yeah. So we're gonna go one, two, which happens to be the four. <gasps> it's your stunt location. My stunt location. So I get a. a boot. Nice. I did it. You did it. Okay. You, you I didn't think I was going to do that, to be honest. I thought I was going to be in the middle. And you get to be the lead player. And I, so you I get, do to get to choose the where the trade That's gate true. is going. You are right. What do you think, Naveen? I don't know. This is interesting. Wow. This is, oh. Don't you don't know what to do. Know what to do. I <laughs> Decision will. making is not easy. This is not, not easy. easy right now. You know what? I'm just going to move it one spot. Oh, okay. One. One of four. You like that ranking? I mean, I don't Still know. Still dealing with that. All right. Let's see. Well, let's see what they're playing. They're playing a purple, purple six, six and mystery. Purple six. Purple six and mystery. <laughs> All right. Well, I know what I'm playing. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay. I will play this one right here. Are okay. you ready? Yeah. One, two, three, reveal. Purple two. All right. I went oh, yellow two. We both, we're well. both selling entangled cards. We are. So one is just, just more valuable. Different. Okay. okay. What and do they, they do? Are playing uh, okay. three orange. So you're the lowest. I, they are the I highest am the lowest. Mid. So where are we? Are we here? Mm -hmm. Okay, so they're the highest, then followed by you. Yeah, so I'm just going to place a banner out here. And unfortunately, I'm, I'm going to do this thing where I create the feast. Yes, we are going to have a feast now. Yeah, <laughs> at the end of the bout. So technically, um, if you were to, to gain some, you would get yes, some supply. That's true, because you resolve all, all of the actions simultaneously. So then it goes from you to this card and me with the lowest, with what the entangled say? cards. I get to place a banner in the quadrants nearest available space this is exactly a reason why so, you would say uh -huh. that one this is why we, we you wait till after the ballot because mm -hmm. he, as you see there's nothing here yes so you and get if it from the supply any additional star fruit you just take it from the supply uh -huh. so i do gain that one and now we have a feast now we have a feast so i have five star fruit you're gonna get five points five five profit you're, you're killing it i'm profiting you're profiting too hard right now <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna get three divided by two rounding up, so I get two points. Yeah. So my three can go in the center, so I'll get two points, I'll take three and give back one. Okay. And I'm gonna put four back in the center, because in a two-player game, you only have seven mm -hmm. uh, for the pool. All right, so that's it. I played the lowest card, is it? Mm -hmm. yep. So I'm the new lead player. How many spaces to move the gate? You didn't move it very far. I moved it one spot. You did. Um, well, let's see. I guess I'll just go one, two, three. Okay. So it'll be in the orange quadrant. Let's see what they're playing. One purple. They're playing the lowest They're value the card. Lowest value. Literally the lowest thing you can play. Interesting. So now you don't really have to worry about that so much. But no. All right. I'm just gonna I'm gonna take a shot at this. You're taking a shot. I'll play this one. Ready? Yeah. One, two, three. Reveal. Oh, oh, it's me. It is you. I tried to sneakily be the highest Did ranked you? with well, a one. We'll see right now. Well, I'm not. But okay. Two. They played a two teal. So wow. highest ranked this is going to be, be you with Miggy's Jewelry. So I'm going to go all the way around. I got I to gotta commit to this because I'm losing and getting profit in any other way. So I have to go with this. You're going so full character deck? I'm going full deck. So let's just get rid of these cards, actually, because they don't really mean anything. And I can go ahead and flip this over. Nice. So now the new target is the three. And now I have 10 points technically uh, showing 10 right here. 10 profit, yeah. Yeah. So, so that's me. That was highest. That was highest. Then it's going to be you. Followed by me. So I'm going to place a banner. Into the tower. Yeah, into the tower. No fruit. No fruit for me. No fruit. And that's it. They're going to be the lead player. So go ahead and move the gate up yeah, three. three spaces. One, two, three. So it's in the yellow section. Yellow zone. And this is their first card. It's a purple, purple. seven. Smoked Ben Clam. Mm -hmm. Ooh. I wonder if that's tasty. Probably not. <laughs> It sounds like a delicacy. For, for them. <laughs> yeah. Maybe for them. Probably delicious, I probably. imagine. All right. I've made my decision. You you decided? Yeah. All right. I'm going to go with this one. Ready? Yes. One, two, three. Reveal. So I played seven okay. teal. Yeah, I played six. Yeah, so I think six. I played the highest thing. And let's see. They, did, they oh. played nine. This is great. This is fantastic. You, it is it? Yes. All right. So they played the, the Lamb V Turbo. Okay. So that, that's the highest, followed by you, Naveen. Me. Okay. So I was hoping that you were going to try to do the thing where you go all the way around because it's the best, almost one of the best times. So mm -hmm. I was hoping you were going to play a higher card. I'm oh. so glad they did because I get to put a banner in a two uh, fruit spot. A two fruit spot. And I get a banner in this region, which yeah. is nice. So I nice. take down two fruit. Congrats. Oh, when you showed Good no play. yellow, I was like, oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> good play, good play. All right, thank well, you. Well, I think I am next, right? Mm -hmm. With my smoke band clam. At the lowest? I was so inspired by that one. No, it's in mid. They played the lowest. Oh, they did, yeah. So I get to place my banner out there. So I get one, one fruit. fruit. 
So you're still eating in the fruit. I wanna I wanna win a feast. You wanna... I didn't like the fact that you got two feasts on Well you it. better start cooking. I'm, I'm trying. <laughs> I'm trying. So they played the lowest, is it? They that played right? the lowest yeah. with the, the purple seven. Oh, so they're gonna move two, up three. three. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. What Here we go. Do? They are playing a yellow one. Mm, that's a tough one to beat. Tusk liquor. I wonder if that tastes. See, that's debatable. <laughs> what, what is in that tusk? Don't know. Gosh, it's interesting. Purple is high, but if I were to play a high card, my watercraft wouldn't move very far. Wouldn't mm -hmm. be really worth it. I'm just not in the character deck game. Maybe I should just abandon that. Maybe strategy. It's 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 tough because then if not, you're letting me take it. I know. For the seven, which is a <sighs> nice little run because it gets sweeter after this. Yeah, um, you're already at ten profit. What's after this? Let's just find out. It's a fifteen, so it's it it just starts gaining like a lot. And I think the best is like twenty eight. All right. Well, I'm just gonna play this one. We only have three merchandise cards left in our hand, by the way. So mm -hmm. it's getting choose tight. wisely. Yeah. All right, I'm going one, two, one. three, reveal. Five. Okay. Right. Oh, with the yellow, yellow seven, yeah, yeah. and they are playing a teal three. So they're the lowest. So highest is you. Me. Yeah. So I'm just gonna go in a big circle right there. Okay. That's me. Then it is me. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna place a banner right there, and I get a a uh, stock root. Oops. Just one. Just the one. Just one. And again, they're the lowest ranked. So the gate moves up three. It goes three, yeah? Yeah, One, because two, it is them. three. Uh-oh. So this is the second to last uh, bout of the day. Uh, first card is a yellow, yellow eight. Yellow eight. And okay. mystery card over here. And again, orange is high, purple is low. Mm, this is tough. This is tough. I think I have to go with this one. Yeah, me too. Ready? You have, okay. One, two, three, reveal. No! Purple eight? Nadine, Did I get the lowest? You blocked my yeah. custom sun pod. Good. This could have been five the profit. VIP tickets. In oh. my pocket. You have enough profit over there. Well, let's find out what they're playing. They're playing an orange. They played six. the highest. Oh, that stinks. I was so, I thought I was, I thought I had it there. Wow. Okay. So they're playing the highest, followed by them again, and then me. So I'm going to place this there. there. Oh, I still More get More banners. Here. Yeah. That's nice. Uh, the, okay, play I played the lowest. lowest. Place two banners in this region's tower. Wow. You're going to have three uh, So banners. I have four banners going into this to your three right now. No, you have four no, banners have, also. Four and four. I have this five. Is, do you have five? I'm saying one, two, three, four. Oh, five. Yeah, because it's the entire five. region. Five. Okay. You have, you have four. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And over here, it looks like two. No, three. Mm -hmm. you, you're winning this. Yeah. <laughs> Gosh. Okay. Well, you were the lead player, Naveen. Yes. So I am the lead player. Okay. So I'll move it one, two, three. Oh, why not? I'll move it four spaces. <laughs> I don't know. The indecision. Yeah. Okay. Ready? Yes. So they're playing a yellow five. Which is low. Real low. That is real low. Well, we and have to play our final card. It. Ready? Yep. There you go. Six. Oh, oh, so I'm going to be able to move my thing around. I yes. The teal four. You played the high. <laughs> nice. Well, let's see what they played. Yellow four. Okay, so you're still. So you're going to get a banner in here. That's the thing that, that's rough. It's a trade off. This, this, I, I'm going for it. So though. you played the highest rank. Six. I'm going all the way around. Nice. We are going to reveal my next card. I need to get to the bottom that's of this. Five deck. profit right there. It was five profit. That's almost as good as a region scoring. The thing is, you're gonna you're gonna put this banner out, create the feast. You're gonna get five yes. to my one to my one. It's a, it's a hard trade off, but it's I have to go for it. I have to go for twenty eight. If you want to keep digging in the character deck, you got to. You going. have to keep going. Yeah. All right. All right, so that was the highest, then me. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna go ahead and place this out right there. So it gets me the two fruit. Yep. Yeah. And now we have a feast. So you get five. So I get five profit. Can I give you six? Sure. All right, here, I'll give you a sixer and just give me one back and then I'll take the one for myself. There you go. There we go. Okay, fruit goes back in. And so that ends day two. Mm -hmm. uh, they played the lowest card. We just have to remember that the neutral player played. So starting day three, we're gonna move the trade day three sure. times. Yeah. But let's go ahead and discard these. And now we'll have some region scoring. Yes. Uh, do you want to do this region closer to you? Sure. I think it's three, three. I think so. So you have two here in the tower. So one, two, three mm -hmm. to my one, two, three. And Ties just, are friendly. Yeah. So six for me, six for you, and then you can we can collect now. Yeah. So we don't Let's get confused. Yeah. Sure. Okay. And then in this region, it looks like I have one, two, three, four, five. Yeah. To my four. To one, two, three, four. Yeah. So you're gonna get six. I'm gonna Thank get you. three, and then I'll just take this one back. Take these back. Okay. And then these will just kind of stay in the tower. So I have yes. three here and you have two there. So. Yes. All right. So then let's go ahead and set up for day three. Care to uh, shuffle. shuffle these, please? Sure. Okay. So here are your eight. Thank you. My eight. And then this is going to hang out here. Last eight bouts of the yeah. game. So they move three. We know this much. Yep. One, two, three. And hopefully I have the nine <laughs> orange. The nine orange? <laughs> well, let's see what they have first. Ready? Yes. So first card for them is a seven teal. 
Okay. And then a mystery. Okay, so they're playing a little bit low. A little bit low here. Interesting. All right. I'm ready. All right. I have a chosen. Ready? I have chosen. One, two, three, reveal. Oh, oh you played the I had nine. It. I happen to have it. <laughs> you needed to, to guarantee that I highest rank? It. Yeah, okay. for sure. Well, they are playing a yellow nine. Oh, well, okay. All right. So highest rank is you. Me. So uh, my watercraft is going to move here, yeah. revealing the next card. What oh my it? gosh, you are almost to the 21. end. 21. I think 21. I only have one more to go, So, but I do not have a target anymore. Yeah, no more I'm stunt location hit. there. Yeah. It is It is it good. It is good. It's yeah. very good. All right, so I'm next. A mid rank card here, so I'm going to place my banner right there. Getting yourself two fruit. I get some two, two fruit. I'm in the fruit game this you are, time around. You are. You're get, yeah. <laughs> I've never really been one to win the feast, you are. but for some reason, things are different this game. So they play the lowest, they yeah? They play the lowest. So it's going to be one, two, three on the yellow. Very good. Okay, mm. so we are in the yellow uh, yellow quadrant. Here we go. They're playing an orange The one. lowest valued card. Nobody yeah. can be lower than that. Nobody can be lower than that. So do not, do not aim to take the action of your card, basically. Exactly. All right, I'm ready. Same. One, two, three, reveal. Okay, I'm three, playing three purple. So we're both in the, in the same spot. Yeah. Oh. They're, oh, well, what so is... They are yeah, the they're highest. the highest. Yeah. Okay, so six teal is the highest, followed by me. So... I'm going there. Same, and then I'm yeah. in the same, because it's identical at the same time, yep. uh, they're going to go at the same place, and then I get one fruit. To Very good. Fruit. All right, so they are the lead player and once they again. the lowest. One, two, three. Okay, so purple. What to do. Purple quadrant, and they're playing purple. a purple four. Okay. Um, and that. Okay, so I think they're getting tough, because in this region, I'm not in it at all. If mm -hmm. I want to score at least three points, I need to have at least two banners. Okay, I'm ready. All right. Well, uh, okay, I guess I'll just use this. Ready? Yep. One, two, three, you're real. All right. Oh, I I'm, I'm low right cards. now. You're low. I'm yeah, low. Yeah, you are low, low. And they are. Ah, they are, so you're going to be the lowest. They're mid range with you, yeah. So they are first, mm -hmm. followed by this, followed by me. So I'm going to place this right there. And I get a star fruit. You do. So mine says, uh, because it's the lowest, place two banners at this region's tower. So VIP, VIP mind, tickets. If I do. What are these tickets to? Yeah. Oh my gosh. One, two, three, four. Ah, oh, this is not looking good. I had to do it. Not looking good for the tentacular trading <laughs> boards. <laughs> That's it, yeah. Uh, so I'm the lowest, so yeah. I get to decide where it's gonna go. I should probably look at my hand. Yeah, how that many would probably be a smart thing. How many spaces, Naveen? How many spaces, Naveen? Okay, let's go. One, two, three, four. Oh, okay. Let's just go far. You're just bypassing just, those, that, that, that uh, quadrant. All I right. I am by bypassing it, yeah. So they're playing a purple one. Which is fairly low. And right there. So we have options here. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm ready if you are. Oh, I'm 50 50. Okay, ready? Yes. One, two, three, you're real. Four. Oh, you Whoa, play, I play the low. Oh, okay, you play do the not low. play lower than that. Please. Please play low. Yellow. They play high. They play the highest. High. Okay. okay, so they're the highest. Then this card. And then me. So I'm going to place this here. Getting yourself a fruit. I get a fruit. All right. So mine is the jellyfish smoothie. And it says gain one fruit for each banner you have in this quadrant. I have one, two, three, four banners in this quadrant. Ah. Uh, so I'm going to get one and then three from the supply. And we're going to have a feast. Ah, uh, that kind of stinks. So before we have this feast, I just want to mention that I wanted to do this because uh -huh. it says I can advance my watercraft two spaces for each of my banners in this region. Wow. That would have been awesome. I would have been able to go up, what, two, four, eight spaces. Yeah, you'd have went around in a big circle. But again, I guess I shouldn't fret too much because I'm not Maybe in the character not. game. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All well, right. Uh, we feast. have a feast. Yeah, so I have five and I think you have five also. I do. So it's tied then. It's a tied. It's like it didn't happen. Yep. So I'll put my five back <laughs> in here and then you can put two and then Thank we you. both get a five each, right? Yeah. So I'll take a six, give back a one. Do you have yep. a six? Or do you have a one? Yep. All right. Thank you. All right. So at least I kind of stifled it just a second. Collecting so much profit. Yes. And All so right. I'm going to be the one to move it, huh? Are you? Yes. You are the lowest the lowest rank. How many spaces? Oh. Yeah. How the heck am I going to do How many do cards? This? We have four cards left. I'm just going to move it four. One, two, three, four. Wow. Max, max it out. We're ignoring two quadrants here I, for some reason. I Naveen did. doesn't like those quadrants. I, yes. That's right. <laughs> All right, well, they are playing a purple oh, eight, which is most likely super high. Be the highest card. And that's that. All right, so I'm ready if you are. Ah, uh, fine. Okay. One, One two, two, three, three reveal. reveal. Oh, yeah. Ooh, so I, I play low. Four and seven. They're playing. Hi. Oh, yellow five. Okay, so we're here. They're the highest. And Am then I the lowest? Me, you're the lowest. Yeah. Nice. Wow, you got in there with a yellow. Yeah. 
Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and place this. Oh, in the tower. Stinks. Okay, it's not nice going into the tower on day three mm -mm. because there's absolutely no benefit there besides just having another yeah. banner. Uh, so it's me then, right? Yep. So the thing says, place a banner in the quadrant's nearest available space. Don't mind if I do. So we just follow here. It goes right there. Knocking over the trade gate. Knocking process. it over and getting myself a fruit. <laughs> nice. Mm -hmm. oh, that's good. That's going to get you a point because we're going to have that final feast. Yeah, right? exactly. All right. Well, how many spaces uh, do we need? How do I, how do I get this to, to work? Back to the opposite quadrant. <laughs> this is tough. This is such a hard decision. Um... Yeah, how many spaces to move the gate in the final turns of the game? Because you're dictating what Support cards it. are valuable and what cards mm -hmm. are not valuable. And maybe you want value. Right. All right, I'm just going to go one, two. Oh, okay. Just like Definite that. Definite two. Oh, I see what you're trying to do here. Yeah. Well, let's see if it'll uh, come to fruition yeah, for right. you. That's what they do. So they're playing a relatively low card. Two teal. Let's just hope this isn't something super high. This is interesting. For your benefit. I know what you're trying to do. <laughs> just, <laughs> I mean, just so you know. I'm just trying. I am aware. I'm just I don't think I'm trying. There's anything I can do to stop it. So I'm going to yeah. play this card. One, two, three, reveal. Okay. Nice. Okay. I played a purple seven. Don't play an orange. Don't play. Don't play a purple either. Don't. Low One, purple. Two, three. Oh. Purple. Oh, yes. Well, it's fine. It's fine. Yes, that's great. Okay. That's great. Okay. So highest is you. Orange. So I just go all the way around. Boom. I'm back. Wow. Ma this is Max. 28 profit in this the pocket. This is Max. Profit in the pocket. Wow. That's it. Ah, I did. You did it. Look at this stunt location. Anytime you make a lap, you get three stunts. Oh, rooms. hey. That's real nice. Sweet. That's not necessarily over for you, right? No, I'm going to go for it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> These two are in the middle, and I play the lowest card with That's a seven. It. My smoked band clown. Uh -huh. I gain one fruit for each banner that I have in the region. In this region. Max four? Minimum one, max six. Oh, and that max includes six. the tower. So I have one, two. Uh, oh, no, wait, where is it? Yeah, this region, right? Yep, so you get five. One, one. two, three. Four, five. Four, five. Yes. Wow. So that's nice. I think one, two, three, four, five. There's only one fruit left in there. Yeah. <laughs> no, I don't want to trigger it. Well, we're going to I mean, you're going to feast anyway, yeah. Yeah, so. Uh, where are you going to move this gate? The last two, last two turns of the game. Mm -hmm. Where do I want to move the gate? Let's see what colors I have in my hand. I'm going to move it four spaces. One, two, three, four. Right there. Cool. So teal is highest, yellow is lowest. And they are playing a yellow four. Yellow four. Another jellyfish smoothie. Low. And that card. Mm. So 50-50, Nabeen. Right. What do you think? I, I have to play this one, I think. Yeah, I'm going to play this card. Oh, do I? Ready? All right, yep. One, two, three, reveal. Yep, I played the lowest. Okay. Oh, well, you played the lowest. Yeah. Unless they play something, yeah. no. They play so the highest. they play the highest. So uh, they're so you're mid. Highest than me. I'm gonna place this <laughs> there. Maybe I get the did. last uh, star fruit. So we might not even have a final feast because we're yeah. gonna have a feast now. Um, and then you play the lowest. So what do you get? To yeah, do? advance your watercraft one space for each of my banners in this region, it includes the tower. So I get one, two, uh -oh. three, four, five. So I'm gonna go one, two, three, four, five. Okay. There we go. So then let's have a feast. Sure, yeah. I have one, two, three, four, five, six. So you get six, six points. Star fruit, oh, yeah. That's just so good. That is nice. <laughs> Thank you. You're the fruit monger. Well, you... uh, I'm one divided by two rounding up, so I get one. Yeah. That's... I mean, you still got a point it's for that. It's a point. It's still, it's still the same exchange, if you think about it. Yeah. You got one to one. I got one. Okay. So you played you played the lowest card, so you get the final say. <laughs> I do. Going into this last bout. I know for a fact that I'm winning this one. So it's, you have one, two, three. So if yep. I punt this all the way here, you cannot put another banner in there. That's right. But would I have been able to anyway? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, to, my, to your four. To and my like some three. cards say put out two in the tower, though. I, you know, there's there's cards that do that. that but the fact true. that you don't know that tells me, <laughs> tells me you don't have that card. <laughs> well, that's not, that's not necessarily true. <laughs> Maybe I just want to give away information. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 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 Hold on. But let's count these. Yes. So I have one, two, three, four, five. To my one, two, one, three. two, three, four. Four. All right. Fine. One, two, three, four. Yeah. I was gonna say either you have a chance at winning this or you well, don't. I don't. Right. So sold. Okay. What do we got? They are playing a teal two, one. One. So orange is high. Okay. Well, you just gotta play your last card. Yeah. One, two, three. Reveal. I got a yellow eight. I got a blue nine. And they, have they yellow six? They play the low. They play the low. No, I played the low. Uh, well, I played the high. No, they played the low. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. Yes, yes. I played the high <laughs> here, so I don't get to do that, which is a thing that you were saying. 
Which is funny. This one does let me place two. You do have it. In the Regent's Tower. That's why I was laughing about it. Like, okay. I did have it in my hand, but I don't get to do that. <laughs> I play the highest card, which just means my watercraft goes That's here. That's good. You, you turn one I, point into three. Yeah. I actually get to play so a character points. card here. I net two points for that. Highest, then them, and then you. So I was really hoping to get this five points by being the lowest because it's like one of the lower values, but they played that one. Yeah. I was hoping that at least once we'd be able to score these the five profit with a nine card because it's always cool. Yeah to see somebody win with that but but this is kind of nice going in here i get to get a fruit and then i think we're tied now in this in this region yes yeah. i gain one plus you get one and you're gonna get a point for that yeah so that's it that is the end of day three let's go ahead and do some region scoring region scoring okay so over here again i think it's, i had five to your four yeah no, one two three. three to your one two three four five so i get six and I get three. Get three, okay. Thank you. Uh huh. And then in this region, I think what did it's we say tied. It so I have one, two, three, yep. four, five to your one, two, three, four, five. Great. So we both get six. We both get six. Okay. Very good. And that signals the end of the game. End of the game, yeah. So let's have one more final feast, yes, which is just feast. you. I get one point for having this one. So yep. I'll get the one. And that's it. So let's go ahead and add up our points. All right, so then you count up all of your profit tokens, add your profit from your character card, and then we'll have a final value. Mm -hmm. All right, I have my number. Same, yeah. Ready? Yeah. Okay, I scored 59. 66. Ah, oh, wow. Yeah. I thought I had it for I so have. long there. You did have it for so long. Was it your character in the end? Uh, totally, that was 28, 28 of my of my 66. Yeah, that was, yeah. That was big for me. I had three profit, a, a whole three profit from my character. You did, yeah. So. And then I tried to set it up so that I would, I would score at least from these towers yeah. to get me uh, to get me 12 at, at least at the last uh, day. So Very good. It worked out, yeah. You know, every time I was acquiring those profit tokens, it just felt, you know. It felt good, it felt yeah. Good. <laughs> it didn't feel good for me. And then, like, this was not a guaranteed thing. Like, I had to make it work <laughs> yeah, to get yes. there around, the, around the, the board. You so did great. It didn't feel good in the moment, like, because I was, especially when I had, like, 10 showing, and I'm like, I need to get through, like, four more cards. I might not have the cards to play to yeah. get me where I need to go. So Absolutely. I'm going down this path, but I got to go for it. I will say this is a wildly different result from the last time we played. Uh -huh. The last time we played, I, w I got totally smoked <laughs> because I don't think I was playing as strategically. You know, this time around, I was able to count how many banners were in each region to make my decision yeah. making. You really have to look at all the factors, right? And also you knowing that I need to get around means... Anytime you, you move your watercraft, mm -hmm. you're not putting out yes. uh, one of these banners, meaning right. that's more opportunity for you to get the area control at the mm -hmm. end of the day. So, yeah. So, pretty good. Anyway, yeah. good job. Thanks. You too. Well observed. Well, anyway, that is Tile Blaze Banner Festival. Thank you so much for watching our gameplay. Again, this game is going to be on pre order starting this week. So, as soon as we have the link for the pre order, we will include it in the description. Thank you all so much for watching the video. We hope you enjoyed it. If you'd like to see more like this in the future, please consider subscribing. Thank you. Thanks. Bye.